hit that subscribe button join the game all that because you know we are vibing we stay lit over here and if you're already part of the fam comment down below and let me know how you doing as y'all can see we've been we we had tons of appointments today like y'all leandre had in the where he has appointments at it's not it's like an uh, hour or so away from us so since like that doctor is an hour or so away, I'm like, they kept on calling like he need this, he need this. I'm like, okay, we gonna be down here this day. Just make the appointments on this day. Y'all, why I tell the people that? Why did he have four, five appointments in one damn day? Five appointments, y'all. And the first one was at 8:30, so we had to get up and get up, get up early and get the moving. Y'all, we was not up early enough because my oldest son misses bus for school. And his school is on the whole other cross of town from where we live. And I'm like, we ain't gonna have time to take you all way across town, go to school, and drive an hour or so away to make these appointments on time. So I had no choice but to let him roll with us and not go to school or whatever. So he had a, what is it, what they call it, a skip day or whatever you want to call it. So y'all, let me update y'all on these appointments. So, now, Leandre has something called conductive hearing loss. So, now they're going to have to, they did some testing for his ears, y'all can see. He was not cooperating with what was going on. So, now they have to, um, basically, they have to put him to sleep now to do the hearing test. Because, as you, as y'all, if you don't know, go back and watch our old videos from when he was born that his right ear, I forgot the, the term of it, but it's like, yeah, it's folded down or whatever. And it's much smaller than his other ear. So that's what we've been seeing how good he hear. When he was at the hospital, when he's born, he failed the test. So that's what was like, ever since then, we gotta see like what's going on. Like, is it gonna cause delays or what? So they're talking, so they're talking about doing the test, but he gonna get the test done for that. And then uh, later on down the road, as he get bigger, you know what I'm saying? And older, he will have to get some type of, some type of hearing aid, but it goes on the bone. Because his, like they say that his stuff is here, but all his stuff is narrow. So, Everything else look good. It just narrow and so small, so they don't know how much he can hear. So depending on how this hearing test goes when they put him to sleep, that they will have, they will be getting. Sorry for the 
loud room in the mess. But they will be doing, um, they will be putting a uh, type of hearing aid on the bone behind your ear. There's something like it vibrates for the sound and then he'll be able to hear out that ear. So we're gonna see, pray for him that this test goes good. Also, another appointment today was for his throat. If you followed before the videos, like I said, go back and watch those videos, you will know about him and him, him with the um, gagging and throwing up and not being able to eat by mouth anymore and all that stuff, that's why he has his feet soon. But if you followed the stories before, you would know. So with that, they will, they're going to do some type of Botox, it's not Botox, but something like that. Some type of Botox type of injection that they're going to put in his throat to try to help that nerve get closer to the good nerve that's working. So hopefully that like when he goes to swallow or goes to eat, he won't get choked up and be gagging. So that's what we are hoping for that that will go well. So they're going to do that and they're going to do the hearing test at the same time and what they're also going to do uh, um, circumcision because when he was born he wasn't circumcised because uh, they were focused on his heart and his well-being uh, you know stuff that's more and more important than that so they're going to do that they're going to put um, do the hearing test do the throat injection and the circumcision all at one time so he won't have to keep getting put under. So they're gonna do it all at one time. So y'all, y'all pray for my baby boy because he got some stuff coming up. And I just hope that everything works out well and that everything is good. You know what I'm saying? Like what they're expecting, I hope it be like what they're expecting. So y'all, and then the other promise he had was like for OT and stuff like that. They say his spine is a little curved, but not curved so much as where they need to worry about it. But they're just gonna keep an eye on it. So they'll see him back in another six months or whatever for that. So that was what the appointments were for today. So y'all, y'all just continue to pray for my boy. Like, man, he only been in the world but a year, but it's been a rough year, you know what I'm saying? And it's like, I mean, it's not bad stuff, but it's like, how many doctors, how many appointments, how many surgeries, how many does, how many did that? You know what I'm saying? How my boy had, you know what I'm saying? Like, and I know later down the road is more to come. So, but I'm just still thankful and blessed that he's still alive and well and that he's here with us. But like I said, don't forget to pray for him, pray for us all that because we always need to pray we always need the prayers and we always continue need the prayers for strength to keep going so y'all yes this was what our blog sober day 11 was a like that's what it was like today but anyways y'all i'm about to i'm on my way oh y'all be like where i'm going i'm on the way to get some food because we was out, I mean, like, we left our house early and then get back to late. So, didn't take nothing out for dinner. And if I did, we were not about to cook because I was tired. Y'all, that today dragged me, honey. It dragged me. But, so, I'm on the way to get to my, so I'm on the way to pick up these wings or whatever. Why do people do this? Why? I, I really hate driving. Like, when I was young, I'm like, oh, I can't wait to drive. I want to get my own ride. And now I just hate that shit. <laughs> I really do. Do, do y'all feel like, do some of y'all feel like that? Because I feel like that. And, like, I really do. Because I'm like, every time I'm about to get in the car, people, every time I'm driving, I see people doing some reckless shit. Reckless shit. But, y'all, anyways, I'm about to pull up. I'm right here at the food. About to, we already ordered so bring my stuff outside curbside honey bring it on outside y'all like i always say don't forget to like comment and subscribe to the channel so y'all can be a part of my fam and all that so you guys see me on y'all lovely screens every day for vlogs over because we are lit over here 
We lit. But y'all, so I'm about to get this food, head on back to the crib, and just we might watch a little Halloween movie or something. I don't know yet. But we're gonna watch something and kick back and chill. But like I said, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to the channel. And y'all have a blessed and lovely night. Peace.